Today, I've been able to locate the, the baboon that was injured, the one which actually had an, an amputation, and I've been very delighted that I've been able to feed it. This is Joseph from Shegu One Graphics presenting you this baboon. You remember this baboon, the first time we caught it, that is the second time actually I was seeing it, when it already got injured and we were trying to give it uh, some soda here. I thought these people were giving it soda, I gave it bananas and peanuts, and they became very friendly until they were satisfied and they started fighting off. But then it got lost completely. I have been there going to the forest without getting it. I didn't know whether it had survived or not. But today I've been able to locate it and actually it is eating. But if you look at it closely, you'll find that the bone is protruding right from uh, where it was injured by the vehicle. So today, as I was just going to feed my the baboons as usual, I encountered this one, and I found some people are even feeding it with with maize corns and um, and uh, other other cereals, bananas, and so on. So I was also able to give it something, and I've been happy to find that it is it is actually getting it it survived the accident, and there has also survived now the amputation. It has survived the accident, but it is it is having a, a compound fracture. On the hip that is protruding. I hope it will get a full recovery. I will be able to be going back if I encounter it. I will be reporting it to you guys. So guys, sit down and watch this video and find out how these baboons are doing in this forest. Thank you very much, guys, for my video watching. Is seeing you like a new stranger today? Yeah, no, uh, they have eaten my bananas. Yeah, come on, come on, uh, baby boy. Just come. Just come. You know, today they have eaten all my bananas. <laughs> so, you yeah. don't know how to feed them. They, like, much. you have to tame them okay. with their age. Okay. If it knows you with, like, the literal age, yeah. it will grow knowing you often. I guess I start feeding the, the baby now. Come on, come on, come on, come on, baby boy. Give it to him. Hey. Oh, so, okay. <laughs> are the ones which are hitting them. Hitting them. Mm. Come on, where are you? And then it got the accident. Yeah, the, the wound is healing. Look at this wound. That wound is near Monday. Yeah. You know, when he was out with Patricia Kuroko, you are hoping you have that now you have to That's where they want to go. This thing. Meshiba. That is Meshiba.
Thinking that they, well, if you are familiar, they start knowing you. Like me now, they, they, they know me a bit. When I come, I used to come with bananas. business. Thank <laughs> you. 
I've been able to locate the amputee, which got an accident. The other, the other video, you remember the previous video when, when they got an car accident? I've seen the bone is still protruding, but it is, get, it is healing actually. It, it, it survived. So it has survived amputation, it has survived, it has also survived the car accident, and it's doing well. So I'll be able to do a follow up and see. People don't get a full recovery, but the bone looks like it is not going to join, but it will remain like a, with a permanent fracture of the bone. So, gentlemen, until next time, this is Joseph from Shegu World Graphics, signing off from Mount Kenya East Forest on the Elephant Corridor, where I was following up on the amputee of the monkey that had got an accident. So, guys, Sign to our video, the share, give, give it a share, and also give, a, give us a comment so that you can be able to know what kind of content you love. Until next time, see you in the next video, guys. Thank you very much.